Hello guys, welcome back to AppSheet tutorial. So today we're going to see about the list expressions. So list expression is a collection of items of same data type. So we can fetch from other table the list of emails or list of names or list of numbers which we can sum. So this, this is a mandatory expression you should learn when you're developing AppSheet. So we can use this for admin restrictions and many other use cases we have. So let's see the demo of this list expression. So in this demo, we're going to do a restriction part like for admins and users. If we are an admin, we can show all of the views. If it's a user, means we can restrict some of the views using uh, admin so first we can go to the data table and we'll create a, like two users one is admin and another one is the normal user so which has less restrictions okay so let's create a sheet called users so if you follow my previous videos you get to know how we created this app and uh, this explanation of previous expressions so just follow this playlist of app sheet tutorial you will understand uh, each expressions before. so yeah, in the users let's create a user email user email and then admin so admin is like is admin or not so for i'm going to use two email ids one of my two email ids so this is one of my email id which i'm going to give the access as admin true and another one is okay. this is my another email id which i'm going to give as admin false okay so this user id will see all of the access to the app and this user will have less access to the app okay so let's import this user table i'm going to add this table so using the select expression and uh, we have another expression in app sheet called in in so we're going to use this both expression to identify whether this user is admin or not so we added the user table here and let's check the columns as yes, are no yeah everything is fine and uh, so now what we can do is so we will show this view called we create a new view and admin views okay so here we create a, we have already the customer data or product database with price okay so this will keep it as center admin view now we're going to show this product view admin product view only for admins so for that what we can do is so this is the view i have created for the product table so this product has the value so this should have some admin access only if admins can able to see the products list so in the display we have one show if condition see optional yes or no formula to decide whether this view should be shown so we are going to use this list expression and in expression in this show if constraint so what we can do is so we have created this user table so using the select statement so first we need to use in so in user email 
so in this user email will give you the current logged in user so currently it will give the my use mpn.altia at gmail.com this id so you see here you will happen this one so this user email will give this one and in select will give the users user email we are going to page table from the user table user email comma where the admin is true so the admin will be true so if you see the select has two parameters one is first one is from which table what we are what is the value we are going to fetch so here we are going to fetch user email so this two we are referring with some condition so second one is the condition so if you see here admin equal to true so whoever is admin value is true that only uh, this select statement will fetch okay and this full expression what does it mean is so in user email the select means so this user will have will in this select list i mean so it will give only this user email id because this is the admin true so it won't fetch this user email id so we are checking this user email is available in this list or not so this is the in function so if it's available means we are going to show this admin view products view okay so let's save here and now we'll check this so we have lots of other views so let's ignore this for so admin product views now i'm thinking that since i am an admin as a value true i am able to see this view this admin product views right so now i am going to switch this email id to this non-admin user okay so now then apply see the admin product views has gone so this is the one of the use case of select statement within this is the main uh in a lot of apps we need to restrict based on the users what type of access to what we need to give so it will be very useful for every app development this expression right so again so for this user i'm not able to see this view now i'm again now i'm able to see this view okay so this is one of the views and the next video we can check about uh, many other use cases of list expression okay thank you guys so if you like this video share and subscribe and if you have any doubts if you want to consult me please check the description link uh, if you have any doubts you can just consult me for free 15 minutes okay thank you